See, I picked my friends like I picked the fruit Like Annie told me that when I was only in you I don't walk around trying to bear what I'm not I don't waste my time trying to get what you got Working and pleasing me goes I can't please you And that's why I do what I do My soul flash free like a willow tree Everyone, welcome to Amazu World So it is 11 o'clock, really quick I just made the children some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches For their first meal Um because it's only 11 o'clock and <laughs> so i'm not making anything major just yet because uh, as you know i practice intermittent fasting from noon to eight so this is what helps me you know just give them something quick and whatnot um until i'm ready like cook cook all right i will see you all right guys hey so as you can see um the children are eating peanut butter and jelly they're eating it in their room uh because it's absolutely freezing downstairs so We've just been letting them upstairs. This is the warmest place and whatnot. But this is how it works for me because I practice intermittent fasting. If they're up way before I'm ready, um, then usually I just go ahead and make them something quick. Or my son or somebody will make them something, my oldest. But she's not here. So I just made them a peanut butter and jelly real quick. They love it. Oh. Alright, so I practice between noon and eight when I'm going to eat. So my husband's asleep. He's been up all day already. I'm running some errands, so I don't need to make anything for him to eat or myself just yet. Um, it was only 11 something, so it's not going to be too much longer. Right now, I'm going to go prep dinner. I have a block of cream cheese I need to use up, so I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with it right now. And I don't want to cook down in a cold, so I'm trying to make it a crock pot meal. So we'll see what I come up with, whether it'll be some creamy chicken or something. I don't know. I know I'm going to make something um, and whatnot, but I will see you all later. Thank you guys for coming to join us. And if anything happens, I will let you guys know. They have their bottled waters. As I showed you guys before, they all have the same bottled water. We have bottles as well. We just refill it throughout the day and whatnot and stay hydrated. It's our main drink of choice in this household. All right. See you later. <sighs> so I just get home, guys. And do you know the freaking water was everywhere? Like a pipe burst because it's finally, you know, warming up. And everything what is life because why does it have to burst near it in a washroom so like that's where we have like our um oh, i didn't unlock my van i'm coming out trying to get our groceries that's where we have our deep freezer and there's a stand in there we got microwave everything is in there pretty much so i'm like super annoyed because i'm over not having water I mean, like, at least from downstairs. We have water in the bathroom and stuff. It's just been very stressful. We have a crummy landlord. I cannot wait. Cannot, cannot, cannot wait to move. Do you hear me? I, I cannot wait. Life has been very hectic, and we only been there for a year. Because the plan was to stay here for a little bit um, until we got enough money to buy our house. Because, like I said, we are on a debt-free journey, so we're trying to do it the right way, and I have to really be stuck in no long-term um mortgages we only wanted 15 years so i'm just i'm just so annoyed y'all I'm, I'm so i won't be eating for a while <laughs> needless to say but check out my audi haul because now i do have an audi haul i'm gonna go ahead and get everything together and then finally make us something to eat and i will see you all then probably one of the only perks about it being super cold <laughs> and i got nice fresh ice bottled water like I said, I leave bottled water in the van all times. In the winter anyway, not in the summer. But, hi, right, I'm about to drink, well, let this thaw out. And then go get me some more water. Alright everyone, so this is the children's next meal. This is their lunch. It is like 4.20 at this point. Um, as you've seen, we were dealing with a lot. But, I made the children what they asked for. They have some turkey burgers, some mac and cheese, and they wanted broccoli, but... With everything going on, it was just quicker for me to make, um, to steam up some mixed vegetables and whatnot. So here's my son's plate, here's my daughter's plate, the two-year-old, hey, and the five-year-old. Oh, not yours. I didn't mean yours, Bunny. I apologize. I didn't mean to show yours. I didn't, boo. They didn't see it, okay? Okay? They didn't see it, okay? They just, they just see See y'all? Did y'all see it? No. See, they said no, okay? All right. Go and eat your food, big girl. All right. So they're going to enjoy... Um, I just made the Crackle Barrel mac and cheese, y'all, white cheddar, but you know, it's me. So I had to add some extra stuff. I got some extra cheese, some sour cream, some butter, some seasoning, 
pretty much how I would have made my own Mom. and whatnot. Because it's just who I am. <laughs> All right, see y'all. Yeah, boo boo. Hmm. All right, so here goes my husband's plate. I'm about to take his up to him. Um, he just has some ketchup meal, lettuce, tomato on his turkey burger. And I gave him some of the white cheddar mac and cheese. I just did not give him any of the mixed vegetables because he's such a hit or miss, y'all, with vegetables. So unless he asks me for some, I'm just going to give him this. All right, see y'all in a minute. Let me go take it to him. All right, y'all, so I'm finally eating my first meal of the day. It is 4.30 p.m., I'm just having, I mean, some of the vegetables, y'all, excuse me. <laughs> I'm just having some of the mixed vegetables, some of the white cheddar mac and cheese I made, and I am having a chicken sandwich I made. I just used one of the chicken parm tenders, and I just sliced that piece off because I like my stuff to be even and whatnot. So I have lettuce, cheese, onion, tomato, ketchup, and mayo on there. And see, it's just white chicken breast. I made it in the air fryer. And yeah. So I'm about to finally eat something. I am like done. <laughs> See you in a minute. And I'm just going to have some. No, I know. I'm going to have water. But then halfway through, I'm going to get some chocolate milk. So I'll let y'all know. Okay, yeah. I don't give the baby any dairy. So what she's eating is some mixed vegetables and some tomatoes. So this is for the baby, the 11 month old. Who will soon be one, y'all. I can't believe it. Alright. Alright, hey everybody. So, it is 8 o'clock p.m. We are all about to have one of these um, little peanut butter ice cream treats that I got from Swans. I took one out so you guys can actually see it. Uh, it's just my husband and I and the baby and Nefertiti and young guy. Of course, the baby isn't eating any of this. But, get us each one, and this will be it. We're about to go play us a game, and that is it for tonight. My son is about to eat a chicken strip, though. I have that in the air fryer. Um, well, I guess I can show you guys that really quick. See, that's cooking for him. He's going to eat one, and then my two-year-old is going to eat one as well, and whatnot. All right, guys, so that is it for today. This is a realistic day of what a family of six eat, even when it gets hectic sometimes. <laughs> as you all can see but they all got full bellies so that's all that really matters all right guys we will see you all tomorrow thank you for joining us much love and peace